Hey guys, I'm Mecha Kera. And I'm Amy Unit 1. And there was a lot of context we just skipped, but I, it was going on for so long. Like, it was going on for so long. And it's just... It wasn't worth it. It wasn't worth it. Because all of this will technically be, like, recapped. <sighs> yeah, recapped throughout the game. She's just so cute. Basically, to summarize it, the game starts with her, yes, with Polka jumping off, jumping, like, falling backwards off a cliff. Like, and, and then it goes to, like, her walking as a small child with her mom, talking about, like, how the moon pulls the sea and makes waves, and I'm gonna fight this thing. Can you do the sword first? No. Oh. We're not... Oh, well, that's right. We're in tutorial right now. <laughs> I just like making that noise. No. No view tutorial. No, I'm not close enough. Shit. <sighs> oh, good. Um, I actually really like the mechanics of how this game works, where it's free roam, free positioning, free attack throughout um, your time limit, and combos carry over into um, other party members. It's currently not two player because we don't have two party members. We only have one. Oops, I hit a button. Sorry. Name As you can see, I've beaten this game. <laughs> um. Ahem. <laughs> Don't mind me. I thought I turned it on and I didn't. Don't mind me saving. This is also a game in the style of save frequent. Save often. Save every time you get the chance to save. Because when you die, it takes you back to the main screen to load in. Where are you? Yeah! Ooh! Yeah, Shade Comet. Like, so, Polka is, by all means, a healer. She's a healer. She is the best healer um, in this game. But she can't heal her, like, her group heal doesn't heal herself until, like, level 40. She finally learned something at level 40 that heals herself <laughs> and the party. <laughs> um, but at a certain party level, you can chain together spells, and she can do her group heal and then her, like, individual heal. Oh, crap. At the same time? Um, or run well, in, a, in a chain, and then... Um, oops. Oops. Um, and the guard triggers are basically, uh, quick time events. Um, the other, like, good healer in this game is Frederick, um, who is our next party member. Um, Unfortunately, I get a little... having... knowing what I know, I try not to get too attached um, to some characters. And I really like using Frederick, but it kind of... it bites you in the butt. Yeah! Heal myself. Oh, there's another dude. Oh, well, shit. I can't run all the way over there, so I'll let him come to me. Shade Comet obviously works from across the map. Very strong. Yeah. Very strong. Screw it. I'm gonna run. I'm do just as much damage. Just as much damage that way. Um. 
The Polka's build is like very strong uh, magic skills. Not good, not good hit. Not strong. Not physical strong. Yeah. Very magic strong. This game is actually really dark. They won't buy for you anymore because there's cheaper mineral powder that's turning them all into monsters. Hello, little squirrel monk. There. Squirrel Compromised. Monk? I think it's a chipmunk. She thinks it's a squirrel. Chipmunks don't have long tails, do they? I don't remember. I don't think so. They have the little stumps. But it's striped like a chipmunk. Yeah. The squirrel thing was because of the tail. It's got long tail. But I don't know about Japan. There could be like long I don't know. tail chipmunks. Oh, here we go. I was gonna like explain the context of what she just said of like I guess you don't wanna touch me either. But like on um, Yeah. It's gonna explain it now. Yeah, the mineral powder. Turn people into monsters. Liam O'Brien's in this game. Yeah. He's in I, every game. I have, I have the ins the booklet I have the booklet insert signed by Liam O'Brien. You realize that man probably actually remember you just sheerly because of the weird things you bring him. No, it's been a while. Mm. It's been like six years. Seven years. Oh god. Gonna have to find you more weird things. I'm bringing Catherine. Oh yeah. So basically you haven't done it since I've been in the state. I had to do math. I guess. Oh lord, that man just fell out of... fell from off screen. And this is really... this is really... this is really sad. This is really sad. This just this just makes me sad. She's she's a pariah because she's a mage and like they die young and everyone's afraid of like get that. Yeah. So which also that character model looks very similar to her mom. Yeah. So, why are they always being like, no, basically? Because they magic is like a terminal illness. The people who can catch, cast magic die young. And the stronger the magic is, the younger they're going to die. Yeah. So they see it as like a contagious illness, even though it's totally not. Is there anything over here? No. There was only a peach cookie. Not that that's a bad thing. Peach cookies heal a lot of health. But yeah. It's just it's just really sad. Because, like, Polka is such, like, the epitome of, like, sweet and innocent and good. And it's just... She gets treated like such a... a monster. Because of something beyond her control. Allegretto. That's that's the that's the other guy's that's the guy's name. Allegretto. Allegretto is I guess one of the lead protagonists, I would say. He's pretty important. Where are we? Shade Comet. Shade Comet. I'm not gonna lie, I love those little monsters. They're so cute. <laughs> Darn it. I was hoping I could get off another shade comet. Oops. I don't have counterattack yet, but at some point, in quick time events, you can counterattack. And it's awesome. And it'll, you know, I'll benefit more by just like smashing X. This is our village. This is our home. 
where nobody thinks I'm a monster, at least not out loud. And my mom is sad. For a reason that gets explained later. Doop, doop, doop. Save point. Save. Always save your games. Always save your games. Otherwise you just get pissed. Yes. Unfortunately, since we have that large chunk where we were recording in the... Do not save over this game. <laughs> there are so many other save files. There are a whole other two save files. Do not save over that game. I will flip shit. <laughs> I guess that does help. That doesn't help, because I think that counts all like the pre cutscene stuff. Oh, well, you know what? Whatever. We. Whatever. Hmm. Is this my house? It might be my house. Ugh, my neck hurts. This is my house. That is my food. This is bread. This is my mom. But see, doesn't that character model look a lot like the character model of Lady in the Market? Yeah. Who's, who's I'm not gonna lie, I, out? all the little houses make me for some reason, though I've never been. Like, they look like the old style, like, Swedish homes that you always saw in, like, movies were probably fake Swedish homes, I don't know. But I would like to think that those homes actually exist somewhere, because they're so cute. And we're depressed. Mom, why does everybody suck? So sad. So sad. It's like leprosy. Leprosy isn't contagious through touch. It is disconcerting to see their skin rotting, though. Basically. Yeah. I'm really just, just. I just. I feel so sad for Polka. And it's like, everything ends out okay, but it's just like, <sighs> little, little munchkin, let me hug you. Let me hug you, sad munchkin. What do you think? Oh, my eyes are watering. I'm not crying, you're crying. No, I'm trying not to sneeze. I'm not sneezing, you're sneezing. Not yet. <laughs> Little orphan boys. That's also really mean. Everyone in this place is just mean. That's also disconcerting. Like, you're gonna poison the bread you're selling? Yeah, so when the little boys steal it, like, you'll kill off a sewer full of orphans? Because that's what it is. It is a sewer full of orphans. That's terrifying. So, for sanity's sake, I'm going to let you play Allegretto. You won't die as much. That's fair. Beat's really squishy. And you're going to use his, accidentally use his special a lot, which is right now is just taking pictures. <laughs> <laughs> and I don't want to give you that power. To take pictures just randomly? No, because you'll go to do something and you'll be like, Yeah, I can attack with this. Camera. I can't attack with this. That sounds like something I would do. What if we do get attacked? We're going to beat them up for XP. We're going to have to edit out a lot of grinding out of this. Because there's a lot of grinding in this. 
We're about to do a lot of grinding. Yeah. Well, maybe we can... I don't even want to say pause. It would be more like, just keep recording and just... Do you know how to do the fast forward thing in Premiere? I haven't figured that out yet, no. Well, I think I kind of do, but... We're going to have to watch a tutorial. This will be our practice one. I'm 94% sure I, like, played with that. But You're I 94 we... cents sure. <laughs> <laughs> That's what I heard. It's actually um, saying 94%. Nope. Here? Um... pieces. Um, options? Um, it says Just for, you know, personal reasons. There we go. Do I have to turn on my controller? Your controller's on. I thought so, but it's not. You don't control things like that. Oh. That's I probably a good idea. I control the things. And I'm still the one walking. Because I'm still the first controller. Uh, but in combat. That was a funny looking rat. In combat, you're going to be out, Greto. So you need to pay attention. Okay. But it'll it'll cue you up that it'll be like, next! Next to uh, um, Allegretto. They look like kangaroo rats. Have you ever seen one? They have those like funny little legs. They're creepy. <laughs> <laughs> I would like to get to the end of the first boss. But... You don't know how long that's going to take. I don't know if you'll want to, like, edit out chunks while we're doing this. Or what. It's up to you. The problem is, it's like looking at it and seeing, it depends on if we're talking through it. You, you know what? If you make a hard cut, you'll make a hard cut. Hey, I... No! Be... No. No, we didn't forget already. Did you forget? You run up and you mash X. Well, that I know. No! What? No! No! Oh, and we're back. There was a tutorial. And it was dumb. It was an accident, but... It was dumb. I made Ava cut it. Because it was dumb. And it was a lot of dumb text. It is the reason she never successfully played this game the first time. No! No! Yeah! Oh, thank god. Sometimes you can get off a combo at, like, the very end. Oh. Sometimes you can't. Like, sometimes it won't let you use your special. Especially with beat. Oh, shit. Just die! I like their glowy tails, though. And Beat has, like, a different close combat move than he does long range. Obviously, long range, he's gonna shoot. Shoot him up, shoot him up. Um. How many of these rats are there? There are a lot. We have to grind, because there's rat boss. And, like, we will not survive rat boss if we don't, like... We're gonna have to go back and forth through this a couple times. Like, through this area. If I took pictures, we could sell the pictures for money, but we don't really need money. Oh, you little bitch. When they get behind you, you can't block. Like, it doesn't give you the option to block. Oh, I was trying to get over there in time. Yeah. Um, and also, honestly, you can do as many special attacks as you can get off in the time limit. I think it gives you like five seconds, but as many as you can do in that five seconds. Mm -hmm. 
I think I can get off like four orange glows in five seconds. Because the timer doesn't stop, I believe. Once you get to... I think it might stop like right now at this party level, but I think after a certain party level the timer doesn't stop. Nope, it doesn't stop now. Oh, that was cool. Yeah. But this is... Oh, I didn't even get to do it. It just takes a picture. It's dumb. If you do sun slash, uh, yep, you'll hit them both. There you go. Victory is mine. You can hit multiple enemies at once, and it's awesome. That's actually really cool. Get this little though. fairy girl later, and she has like the rings, the Cestus rings. Ooh. And oh my god, she is so awesome at just like building up like hits. Um, items. Cool. I'm good, but you needed a cookie. I think I went out of that screen and then back into that screen. Mm -hmm. I just walked up on a rat on accident. Oh, or whatever. And, like, apparently I decided I'm going to... Sh there we go. At least I hit the close one for that. Oh, good. It's you. Oh. But yeah, as you can see, just off the health bars alone, uh, beat is significantly squishier than uh, red of. Yeah, that stupid mice. They're like the oh, and that one blocked. Die. I love this game so much. I love this game so much. Like Look, level up! We leveled. Now we have to do that at least another like three or four times before we're ready to fight the boss. So we need to be what, level four or five? Yeah, that's fair. Here's a switch. Let's give it a push. We didn't even touch it. We used our minds. We are gonna kill this rat though. These three rats. Deceptively large amount of rats. Oh, yeah, if you had just, like, re-angled yourself just a little bit, you would have hit both of those. I was trying to do it, but I just didn't get it quite right. Which is a bummer, because it would have died. I know. Oh, my eyes are tired. Oh, crap. Oh, good. Because Phantom Wave does a lot of damage. I really like that one. That one's really pretty. Yes, it's really cool looking. I really like the mechanic of doing different attacks in the light um, and dark areas. I think it's it's really interesting instead of having like a skill list. And I think it's really cool when you start building off of combos with everybody. I think that mouse is going to jump towards me, but we'll see. Because he's facing me. I was like, I'm just thinking about it, just thinking hard. Why did you do that? What did I do? You used an item. I didn't mean to. Why would I do that? Why would I attack the farther one as opposed to the one? Oh, God damn. Ah, so not close enough. I do kind of also dislike the targeting system sometimes with beat. Because it's like, oh, it's like right there. Oh, look, there's this thing right in front of me. Let's attack the thing 20 feet away from me. That's smart. Yeah, we might need cookies. Like actual us? Mm. 
mm, we could go with cookies too, but I meant us. Oh no, we're fine. I took some hits, but I didn't know how badly. But it was fine. So never mind. It's like triangle to switch character. Well, you know, we have no characters to switch through. Not yet. Just beat Nalgrand. We get some pretty great characters, though. It's a shame, because you never have to see Viola, and I think you would have really liked Viola. She's really cool. Hmm. She's like a huntress kind of build. Oh. And she had like a bow and arrow. I say had, but we haven't gotten to the point. It's not like she is lost to us. I'm just ah, stoked to have like a full party of Polka and Beat and Rado. Oh, because she has an option of three? Mm hmm. Because we're playing. Oh. Well, it's. it's. Or can you hold up to three in your party, anyways? You, you have three people in your party. It's. So the thing is, is. Um, once we get larger party, um, I was I was gonna keep track of Polka and other party member. Let's just let's just see. That's pretty. Let's just see how the boss is. Have like I know who who we lose as party members and like who's worth upgrading regularly. Yeah. And honest, obviously, you need a lot of money if you're going to upgrade everyone, but you don't upgrade everyone. Because you get, like, an option of, like, 12 to 16 different people. Yeah. Took a lot of time to run over there. Yeah. That is the downside. Fortunately, once he's like up on you. Oops. Um, it's just really it's a lot easier to just run around behind his back. Oops. you. Oh, shit. Um, right now it's not a problem because we have infinite tactical time. This infinity TT at the top. Um, so you can just stand there and do nothing for as long as you want. It's not going to matter. But um, at a certain point, I think it's like once we hit party level 2, we only have 5 seconds. And then once you move, um, once you move now, I don't think it does anything, but <sighs> eventually, I think at party level two, once you move, it, like, time continues to tick. Whereas this, once your special's done, and you don't move anymore. Oh, good. And you're close enough that he's not gonna, like, do the ratty restore thing. Sweet. We did yes! it! Yeah! Itchy, 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 itchy. You got a weapon upgrade! And a rat tail. Yeah, and a rat tail. It's our orphans. What which we take care of? Sewer orphans. At least the sewers look nice. It's not like they're terrible looking. Yeah, but they're just giant rat infested. Well, yeah, there's that. Giant kangaroo rats. And what looked like a flying squirrel, not so much a rat. 
क्या Why is bread so expensive? All I can think of is, please, sir, can I have some more? Yeah. It's all Liam O'Brien's fault. Not him personally. But, like, <laughs> his character is, like, the king of the land, and he is the evil king. And... Braddy evil king. Damn it, Liam O'Brien! You and your amazing voice. Somebody is going to like put that that clip somewhere and he's going to see it and I'm going to hear about it on Twitter. <laughs> but he's I love his voice. Or better yet, I'll hear about it at Sack Anime and we'll just be like, no. It's like don't no. hate me. <laughs> oh. The Count of Forte. No, he keeps the cat Cat, cat, cat. Fra, fra. He <laughs> keeps the cat on mineral powder cheap. No, he keeps the tax on mineral powder cheap because he's making it. And he's making all the money off of that. And it's manipulative of other people. It's harming them. Turning them into monsters. Oh. It's only 8.30 and I'm like ready to go to bed. I feel it. We're old people. We're old. Yeah. No, we're extra old. I threw out my hip. I don't know what's up with it. So one of my coworkers can legitimately pop out her whole hip and pop it no. back in. And it is the most painful sounding no. thing. And you can physically, like, watch her do it. And it's just no. like, oh. Ugh. Oh. No. She did it for me a couple weeks ago and I was just, like, cringing. Focus in her like, room, depressed. <sighs> Sad child. Itchy. Itchy everything. Itchy, like my finger is now covered in makeup, which is what I was hoping to avoid. Look at us, chillin', eating our bread. All the bread. Magician girl from yesterday wasn't around. Alligator is very aware. Wink. Oh. Wink, wink. Aha. Uh -huh. Nudge, nudge. Hint, hint. <laughs> uh, uh, Fair enough. Criticizing Beat's photography skills. Beat. That we were just criticizing. <laughs> it's not terrible. It was his dad's camera. Aww. So cute. Mm. Will you do my favorite? Can you throw this over there? <laughs> Thank you. It was uncomfortable. Only people who die soon are able to use magic. He's so cute, though. Beat? Mm -hmm. He's adorable. Just not that great in long game. That's fair. But he's just, he's cute. Because as far as range characters, Viola's way better. But I'm pretty sure you have to aim with her. Mm. Which sucks. But, oh my god, when you get a hit... Oh. Oh. Oh, the damage. Oh, the damage. Oh, that feathered pauldron. You know what I can't wait for? Disneyland. Oh, Disneyland? Yeah. Disneyland! <laughs> No, like a month. Oh my god, that's like two two months. Our End birthdays of September. are coming. Yeah, our birthdays are coming up really fast. So I know my brother's birthday's today. Oh, 
He's oh. up camping. Good for him. Yeah. For our birthdays. They leave first thing in the morning. Them. I was gonna say my brother already left. <laughs> not your brother. Your brother's gone. <laughs> Gone far away. Oh, look! Opening credits! So, with the opening credits, we're gonna call this a a thing. Chickens! Sorry. I have this obsession with yelling chickens every time I say chickens. It started with playing Link. Zelda. Like, every time I'd play, like, Link and I'd see something, you'd just hear me scream chickens. Ugh! Ugh! Because I liked attacking them even though they attacked me okay well anyways sorry um this is where this is where we're gonna stop for this chunk so we're, we're good now this is gonna be really edit heavy but you know what oh and sam oh oh well, i didn't know that yeah. it's we'll look at the voice actors real quick yeah beat beats a lady like most small boys how <laughs> well that under you know Chopin Patrick Sates is a great voice. Okay, well that was uh all we're getting for right now. So yeah, no, we're good. We're good. Uh see you later. Kaiju out.